Hey everybody, you know who it is, it's Unbox Everything and today we will be unboxing something very special. I have been waiting to unbox this and to get my hands on this more so for a, for a while now and I can't wait to show you guys so let's just jump right in. Okay, so you may have already seen on the side there is a box here that I already have. It's this. Um, this is the website where I got it from, it's called shop2.net and if you guys are wondering what I have here then feast your eyes on this, not this. Ta-da! I got, managed to get my hands on a Nintendo Switch and this is the original Switch which has been surprisingly, well, I mean, maybe not surprisingly, it's been out of stock everywhere for the longest time. I don't know how I got so lucky, I just did. I happened to actually check that website, shop2.net, um, and I and they just happened to have it in stock, and they had this bundle, this was the only one they had, and I was like, do you know what? I'm not gonna wait, I'm just gonna get it. And I got really lucky, and I, I managed to get through, I managed to get it, and I managed to, to buy it. Yeah, I really can't wait to unbox this thing because I've been wanting to get one for a while. Um, so yeah, let's just jump right to it. You guys can see this, right? So as you can see, it's the OG Switch. Um, I really wanted to get the original one because uh, for one really big reason, and that's because you can dock it, as you can see in the picture. Oh, and there we have it. I'll be scratching that off to download the game. Um, I thought it came with a physical copy of the game, but I guess it comes with a um, a digital digital download. Um, luckily, I have a 64 gigabyte micro SD card um, laying around somewhere, so I'm actually going to use that. Um, so yeah, I'm going to put this away. This is important. But yeah, there it is. Um, that's the main screen itself. I'm just going to take this out. Oh, it has a nice... It has a nice weight to it. I really like it. Not really much else. I'm, I'm probably not going to take it out just yet. I'm just going to leave it inside its packaging. I'm going to see what else there is inside the box. Um, but yeah, it's, it's got a nice like weight to it. It has that little flimsy stand at the back and it has like all the all the connectors and stuff at the top. But yeah, um, I'm just going to put this off on the side as well, just, just on the couch for now, just so that we can see what else is in the box. So I'm going to take out the first um, controller. Oh, again, it has, this is, this is like a tiny, tiny bit of weight to it. I quite like it. Um, I guess we can take this out and see. Oh, it's got a nice like matte, matte finish, um, which is nice. Um, yeah, feels feels pretty good. Nice and nice and clicky buttons. This is really cool, guys. Um, I'm just gonna put this off on the side again. Gonna take out the other controller. I mean, it's same similar story. Just take it out. Similar story. It's just basically like a controller, and you can use it both ways. So I think this one you can use it like 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 so. If you're playing two-player games, obviously, um, you can share the controllers, and you, one person holds it like this. And then the other person holds it the other way. Oh, actually, no, it's like this actually because the shoulder buttons are inside here. So, what's this? Oh, so this is um, this is for the controllers. You can um, you can dock them in here, and you can have like a proper joystick, which is really cool. Not sure how much I'll be using this. I've actually um, read online that um, everybody recommends the the Switch Pro controller, which I will probably get because I will be playing games like Zelda Breath of the Wild and I really can't wait to play that game. But it's it's really nice the fact that they do, um, you know, give you this, something like this. So yeah, it looks like they give you some cables. And so these are HDMI cables, which is very nice. Uh, again, I, like I said in one of my previous videos, I always welcome stuff like this because this kind of stuff always comes in handy. So nice little addition and you get your usual power adapter and this is powered by USB-C which is amazing I didn't know that but yeah this is the power plug <clears throat> it's a USB-C uh, power plug which is great I didn't know the Nintendo Switch uh, was USB-C compatible uh, what else oh here you got strap oh uh, okay I see this is cool so this is just like a strap that you can attach to your switch controller um, 
it's I think it's something to help you with the actual um, pressing of L and R buttons when you're playing two players, which is which is really nice, which is really cool. Really like it. I remember when this when the switch came out, people were um, accidentally locking them into place, and they were putting the wrong one on the wrong side, and they couldn't get them out. Um, I don't know if the issue has been addressed in in this, but um, if it has been, great. I think there may have been a fix found anyway, in case you know if, if that does happen. But hopefully not. Um, but yeah, it's good that they add. And oh, and this is the other one. So there's two of these, um, which is really nice. And they have they have the, um, the the plus and the minus signs there, so you know which controller, um, which which strap goes to which controller essentially, which is really nice. Um, I'm just going to put this down in here actually, and. I'm not sure what this is. Oh, okay, I know, I do, I do. It's the dock. So this is the dock. Um, so this is where you dock your Nintendo Switch. And as you can see, this is the front of it, I'm guessing, I'm assuming. Um, so it's got like the Nintendo Switch um, logo and the name of it, which looks really nice. And it's kind of like a matte finish. It's, again, it's got like a bit of weight, not much, but you can feel something, which is nice. Um, it's got two USB ports. Um, again, I'm assuming to charge your controllers or something. Um, I've never owned a Switch, by the way, guys. I've never really... I mean, I played... I have tried a Switch before, but I haven't... Not extensively or anything. I, I'm assuming that this kind of bit here is where all your cables go, because it says HDMI here. So it's kind of where you can hide all your cables. I'm not sure how you open this. Oh, okay, you just kind of flip it backwards. And okay, so this is where you kind of plug everything in. And then you kind of just hide your cables in this little compartment, if you guys can see, which is really nice. So on the side here, you got a USB-C where the AC adapter goes in. You got a USB uh, type three uh, connector here. And then finally you got a HDMI out. So that's that's where you connect your switch to your TV um, to export the signal. And that's kind of it. Let's let's put the controllers in. I'm gonna be I'm gonna try and be really careful. I really need to get a screen protector for this. Wow, this is so shiny. Look at that, guys. That is super nice. That is so nice. I don't know why my voice is getting so deep. Um, <laughs> yeah, this is really nice. This is really cool. And I've never tried the back, um, the, the flip. I don't know how that works. I think it just kind of pops out, doesn't it? Um, don't really know how it works. I, I know I've read that it's quite, it can be, it can be quite flimsy. Oh, I see. Interesting. And that's where your, that's where the micro SD card goes. So it's kind of in the same little compartment as the, as the switch stand. I mean, it does feel very flimsy to be fair, but at least it's there to be honest, you know, at least they give you an option to, um, you know, to, 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 to make it stand, you know, if you don't have anything else, but yeah, oh, I really don't want to get fingerprints all over this, but yeah, this is so cool. I really, I can't wait to try this now. Um, yeah, I'm going to put a, a micro SD card in there. Oh, I have a Nintendo account. I just don't remember what it is anymore. Like it's just, yeah, it's just these things that always get lost. Uh, game card goes in here in the top. So that's if you buy an actual physical copy of a game and this is where you put your cartridge in. It's got a headphone jack here. I assume that's where the, the heat comes out. It's got a little heat sink I can see inside just there. Um, and I assume that's the volume button and that's the power button and that's it. Very simple, very compact, very contained. I do like it. Um, yeah, it's... It's just kind of everything in one. Oh, wait, what? It turned on. Oh, snap. Okay, I turned it on by accident. Um, yeah, why not? You know what? Let's see if we can uh, if we can go through a few settings and let's see what happens. Let's see what. So it's telling me to put in the the Joy Cons in. So I put one in. Put in the, the other one as well. This is wow. This feels fantastic. So okay, they've, they've clicked in now. Oh, here we go. There we go. Ooh. Wow, that's awesome, guys. That is awesome. All right, well, you know what? Since we're here, let's just set it up.
And there we go. All right, let's choose our time zone. And let's go to London because that's where we are. Connect to a TV. You can enjoy Nintendo Switch on a larger screen by connecting to a TV. Uh, we'll do that later because I'm nowhere near connected to a TV. So detach the Joy-Con controllers. Do not press any additional buttons when detaching the Joy-Con controllers. Hold the rear release buttons and slide the controllers up. Okay, let's try that and let's try not press any buttons while doing that. There we go, there's one. There we go. So if we put this down here, just so you guys can see. Oh, okay, so they are now connected to one another. So now I've got, I'm holding both controllers like this. Use the left. Oh, okay, I'm gonna do this all later. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna have to sit down with this. I'm gonna have to go through all of it um, in a bit myself, but I'm just gonna go back and yeah. Like I said, it's been really difficult to get a Nintendo Switch. So finally being able to get one and finally be able to hold one in my hands feels great, especially in a time like this, crazy time like this. So yeah, looking forward to, to just kind of um, getting to know it really i mean yeah in a, in a weird as weird as that sounds hope you guys enjoyed this video please leave a like comment and subscribe and take care stay safe peace